made it look divine where you came from Just wanna know your name Just wanna show you things I mean I would've said that Denim shirt, wrap that arms around her waist The moccasins is what locked me in Couldn't be your way, girl I need to stay I mean I tried to leave but I can't go Her favorite band is what paint But her favorite song is by Sango Now she's here with me Sitting in the style Hey guys, it's Brittany again and today I have another wig slash collab video I told you guys I'm going to be doing a lot of them this month um, I have about I think I have about two or three left in this month and then I'll be done for a long time. But anyway, I'm going to be collaborating with Makeup by Kiani. I found her probably at the beginning of this year. Um, she is obviously a makeup artist, but she also loves wigs. That's how I got in contact with her. She wears a lot of blonde wigs, so that, that's kind of like her signature thing. So we decided to do a collab together, so definitely check out her video after you check out mine. Uh, shout out to her for collaborating with me. So I'm going to be doing the full review on Model Models Janica. So I featured Janica in my wig lookbook that I did with Cameron Monet. So if you haven't seen that video, go ahead and check it out. I'm going to put it on the info card for you guys. And in that video, um, in the comments section, you guys were going crazy over Janica. This one was the most popular out of all three of the wigs that I featured in that video. And rightfully so, because this wig is gorgeous. I showed you guys uh, the cap construction and the footage before this. Two combs in the front, comb in the back, and adjustable straps. This cap is definitely big hit friendly. Um, so I did have to adjust my straps for with this one. The texture of it is a yakky texture. So it looks like um, African American hair that's been permed. Um, or if somebody with natural hair got a really nice blowout and pressed. And the color I have on right now is OM430P. And this is one of my favorite color mixes by Model Model. And the equivalent to Free Trust is OP430. I love those color mixes. It's just a really nice brown mix gorgeous brown mix it has a dark root and then it goes into the brown colors i haven't gotten any shedding or tangling i don't think i have to worry about it because it's such a short wig okay so this wig the longest part is about 12 inches long and i'm six feet tall and this is how it falls on me the shortest part which is in the back is probably about maybe six to eight inches long in the back and then it gradually goes to the longer part in the front. I've gotten minimal shedding, not like too much. Now what made me want to get this wig, I was watching Bettina Styles review on this and she had it in the other color I'm going to show you guys and she was going crazy over the bang like she kept touching it the whole video and I definitely understand why she was touching it the whole video because this bang is epic like this bang is so pretty. This is this is what I like with wigs. I like a swoop bang and I like a little bit of volume to where I can do like a feathered bang if I wanted to. And I think that's why I didn't like pansy that much because somebody pointed out maybe you didn't like it because it was flat. And I think that's why I didn't like pansy that much. It was, you know, it was a bob but it didn't have that much volume like in the bang area. And that's what I like. This bang is so freaking beautiful. And the texture, the texture of it just looks so natural. The only downfall to this wig is the parting space. It doesn't come with lace, which is a good thing because I, you know, that's one less step to do. But usually with wigs that don't have parting space, uh, that don't have lace on it to cut off, the parting space can be thick and it can be hard to blend. But um, I still made it happen. I did tweeze a lot out of the parting space. And then I put my Maybelline Fit Me pressed powder in color uh, 330 toffee. I put that in my in my pardon space, and I think it looks pretty decent. It looks pretty good. I actually tried with my other um, Janica not using the pardon space at all, just kind of taking my edges out and blending it that way, and it still works and looks natural. It'll just look like a full sewing kind of look. So uh, you can definitely do it that way, but I still tweeze the part on that one as well. I just didn't put any powder in it. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep raving about this wig. This wig is beautiful. It's beautiful, and I bought this from Wig Types and. 
on top of it being all of that it's only $18.99 y'all $18.99 everything doesn't work out for everybody and you know I'm just sharing my opinion so definitely watch other people's reviews before you decide on purchasing this wig because I don't want you guys to come back and tell me how much you hate it and everything but I really do like this wig and I think it's gorgeous but always take every review you watch with a grain of salt because everything looks differently on everybody so I am gonna switch into the other color and I'll be right back okay guys so I'm back and I have on the other color now this color is the OF 99 J 530 BG so it is a burgundy red mix um, it has a dark root and then it goes into the burgundy mix but it is a subtle red so if you're kind of you want to try red but you don't want it to be like in your face red this is a very nice subtle red but it's a little bit bolder than a 99j like because it's a 530 mixed in it so it's like a nice happy medium yeah i love red colors and yeah I like the way this one falls a little bit more than my 99J Dream which is which is pretty funny yeah this is really nice and with this parting space I did not utilize the parting space on this color I just tweezed the part but I didn't put any powder in it and I mean I still think it's passable I mean you can obviously like I showed you in the with the last color you can tweeze your part put your powder in it and do it that way but you don't have to necessarily put powder in it and everything like you normally do it'll still be passable and look natural if you don't like do a whole bunch of manipulation if you just bring your edges out it's just gonna look like either your hair or a full sew-in so I think this wig is great all summer ever since I tried dream like these bob length yakky textured wigs with like a swoop bang have been just you know doing it for me like this is so cute. Um, so if you are interested in Janica, I'll put a link in the description box. If you have any other questions that I didn't answer in this video, please let me know. Uh, don't forget to watch Makeup by Kiani's video. Shout out to you. And tell her that I sent you if you go over to her channel. Follow me on Instagram at IFancyCupcakes. Follow me on Snapchat at HeartsandCake90. I'm not on Snapchat as much as I am on Instagram, but I'm trying to learn. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.